Fifty-six. Hello there, it's Hector. Hector Brocklebank for HB Props about the delivery. Yeah. But I cannot drop delivery off until I can that you've got the stuff there, you can. Um, you can't drop it off. Why can't you drop it off? Well, I need to know that you've got the water tanks and the wood. For, um... Twelve live, fully trained beavers and a giant mechanical beaver named Justin. Okay. Well, um, I have no idea what you're talking about, so you need to enlighten me a little bit. A pun leads for Justin Beaver to ride on at the end of the show. So you need to know if something else is a ride for that event? Aye, I cannot drop off the live beavers unless yeah. water tanks is there. Right, let me just get the production office. Bear with me one second. Hi, Darren, you right. Yeah, good, thanks. Darren, I've got a gentleman on the line. He's trying to make a delivery in of live beavers for the Justin Bieber event. But he needs to know who, if the other part of the order has arrived, and I have no idea who to put him in contact with. Is there anyone, cause anyone in the loading bay that would know it's some wooden panels and some other stuff that he needs for these live beavers? He can't make the delivery without these parts being there, like the water and stuff like that. Somebody's having in my number. I don't want to take his live beavers here. <laughs> but he said he's not going to deliver in if the rest of the crops aren't there because he can't bring the live beavers in without that. So I just have no idea. All, all he knows is it's for Justin Bieber and there's a mechanical beaver coming as well that he's going to be ending the show and live beavers. All right, darling. Thank you. Bye. Bye-bye. Right, I just spoke to the venue one. He doesn't know anything about this either, so what he's going to have to do is go in and try and find somebody that's expecting your delivery. Uh -huh. That means speaking to the Bieber team. I have no idea, but he said it might take him a bit of time. Uh -huh. Are you well, on route with these? Aye, I'm, I'm just here just now. I, you haven't got a bath or uh, some way that I could just leave them with you? A bath? Uh -huh. I've got, I got a shower, but that's about it. Oh, yeah, sure. Uh, well, that would be okay, I think. I'm the vet, you can. I don't really care that much about him. Would you be prepared to put the, the beavers in the shower? No. No. I'd be too scared. I've got one uh, here. Look. They're very gentle. No, you're, you're all right. Lovely little you're things, you can. I bet they are lovely, but oh, 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 oh. they might bite me. No, um, no, we don't know with that. You're, you're too right. nice a lady to be bitten. You're an half a nice lady. <laughs> What's your name? Um, Karen. Karen. Uh -huh. Well, yeah. listen, Karen, before you go and phone anybody else, can I let you into yeah. a little secret here? Yes. Karen, we're just pulling your leg. It's Robin Galloway here from the Heart Breakfast Show. <laughs> You're so awful. No, I just wasted my time going so, round there I looking for them people for you, and they told me it was a prank. I didn't think you'd make the call. <laughs> I have to ask. I did think it was weird that they were going to put live beavers on the stage. Justin Beaver. <laughs> I did think that, and all over. I thought, no, they wouldn't do that to me. All right, you were great fun. Thank you. I hope you have a bye. great day. Bye. You too. Bye. Take care. Bye.